guess what? I got my BoxyCharm for the month of January. If you are new here, my name is Kyla. And if you do not know what the BoxyCharm box is, it is a beauty subscription box that you pay $25 a month and can receive up to five. And I mean five full-size products. You can either receive skincare or makeup or both. And each month you do get a chance to choose a product that you want to receive your following month or the following month. Other than that, this is an awesome box, okay? Now, for those of you that are wondering the weight of this box, the weight of this box was 1.4 pounds. But it seems a little bit more hefty than 1.4 pounds. That's all I can say about this box. So I'm not think I don't think that the weight is accurate anymore as much as everybody thinks. But I'm still going to go off based of the weight. On the inside, you you do receive you do receive I'm just not making sense today. You do receive a pamphlet every month with the products you get listed on the back of this pamphlet. Uh this month it's called Fresh Start. I usually read the variation number, but the very there is no variation number. It's just like a C2 -la 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 on there. It's it's all mixtures right here. Whole, hope, hopefully it'll show. Anyways, you get the point. It's not showing. But I will say that maybe it's BA. Variation BA. I'm not sure. Alright, so we're going to go based upon the list here. The first product in here is the Ciate London Velvet Eyeshadow Palette. I am shocked with this one. This is the one I wanted. I was scared I wasn't going to get it. And I'm just, I'm, I'm thankful. Uh, this, uh, da, 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 da. it says create molten, molten metal and matte looks with this palette featuring a mix of hyper metallic soft shimmers and velvety smooth mattes. Uh, the innovative powder formulation delivers high pigment with super soft application. And for this palette is $30. And the packaging here is velvet filling. It's like an anti-slip kind of, uh, cardboard here. I'm trying to open now I did try this out already not today but I tried it out a couple of days ago which I'm already tearing and I love it but there is a little bit of a uh, con which I don't I don't know if you should call it a con but if you go to scratching this palette you can scratch it I ended up scratching it trying to open up the box Now, the con that I'm talking about is these shades are so soft that if you go to drop it, just a tiny drop, it will shatter. It will bust up like butter. So, here's what they look like. I'm going to show you. Now, I will tell you uh, most... Okay, I'm going to say this. One of them is not glued completely. And I'm not sure if it's supposed to be a magnet, but I don't think it is a magnet. It's got glue underneath it, and it just popped right out uh, when I first opened it. So that's that's the only other con that I've had. So you may have to glue it back in there. But these shades are so beautiful. Look at that. That I've tried it out, and I'm shocked. I'm going to uh, show you. Let's see how many mats are in here? There's one, two, three, four, five mats, I believe. Yeah. So I'm going to swatch my favorite shades here. So I swatched one, or not one, I swatched, yeah, one matte, which is one of my favorite shades. This is more of a pinkish orange shade and a very light, it's kind of, kind of like a sunset shade. So beautiful. And then, let's see, was this one the pink one? Yeah, then I got a pink shimmer here, which is wonderful. It's beautiful. And then the yellow shade. So I'm going to go ahead. And you can use your, uh, what do you call it? Setting spray with this. And it just makes it pop. It makes it like explode off, like the color 
explodes to where it you just see the pigment okay look at that aren't those pretty yeah i only decided to swatch three because these three these three i was playing with a couple days ago all right so there is that and like i said the value of that thirty dollars the next thing in here is the pharmacy deep sweet two percent bha for cleaning toner an alcohol free two percent bha toner that gently exfoliates deep cleans pores and controls oils without over stripping skin ideal for combination oily or acne prone skin retail value for this twenty dollars and this is super super heavy i would think that this would be worth a lot more <laughs> than your average toner or exfoliating toner but i am pretty happy to have it because I've been dealing with maskne really bad which is like under the makeup I'm using so I will be giving this a go but it does come in a glass bottle so if you're somebody like me that tends to drop these things just just be careful okay be careful <laughs> but this is a good price The third product in here is, oh, this is my favorite. This is my favorite. Oh, man. And I chose this. Thinking maybe it's not going to be for me because I've had issues with these kind of tinted moisturizers. But this is a godsend for me. This is a godsend. This is a pure 4-in-1 tinted moisturizer. Try and check see if it's dirty because I've used this every single day, every day, along with a color corrector that I am obsessed with right now, the Jack, the Jack of Black. You use this under this, and bam, you've got your color corrector in there because it doesn't have a color corrector in here. But I'm telling you, those two products, you want to have something like that, you've got it all in one. All right, a multi-purpose all-in-one broad spectrum sunscreen moisturizer primer and foundation with SPF 20 that's part of an effortless beauty routine for an beauty routine for an ultra natural looking complexion. The retail value for this $35. And I would say no 30 $35 for this, but dang, this is this is worth it. This is something okay. I don't freak out about certain things like this unless it's something that has shown progress, has made my my mind blown. So I'm just shocked, okay? This is what I'm wearing right now, okay? This is what I'm wearing. I have acne underneath, uh, underneath this. But as soon as I apply, my, you can actually apply a primer under this even though it has a primer. And the primers, it's not really a primer primer, but the primers I am using with it, these are the ones that I've tested with it and actually stays. It's a Tasha uh, Silk Canvas uh, Primer. And then I've used a thing that doesn't contain, I don't think this contains silicone, but if it does, it's, it's still good, it's amazing. And this is the Soft Focus Glow Drops by Rhode Isle. This is the illuminating one. This goes on, and then I go ahead and apply this on the areas I need to apply it for color correcting, and I put that on top of my acne. You might be able to see the acne just a little bit here, but then when I apply this, it's magic. You wouldn't think, you'd be like, okay, this is not a medium or a full coverage tinted moisturizer, okay? It's a light coverage. You can build it up just a tiny bit more by applying it first, and then wait about a minute or two and apply another coat this is like oh my gosh i don't even know how to explain it it like covers all imperfection makes your skin look filtered i'm serious i'm no lie about that i'm telling you right now my family who may be watching this and they know my reaction when it comes to something like that or something like this but look at that it comes with the most beautiful glow when you rub it into your skin like whoa wow i'm okay let's just say it's speech i'm speechless right now speechless this is going to be something that i'm going to repurchase for sure especially 
the fact that I gave this a try. So if you're looking for something like a tinted moisturizer, get that. Step on it. Seriously. All right, the move on. <laughs> the fourth product is the Seraphine. Okay, I will tell you this. When you fill out your profile, um, Boxy wants to get to know you so that way they know what products to send you. And for a long while, I was just like, they got me and then they don't got me. Like, they understood me and then they didn't understand me. Like, they would send me products I have specifically said no to. And then they'd send me products that I've said yes to. But this month, I'm, sh I'm shocked because they sent me everything I always ask for. Like, or the things that I have on my list. They actually followed it. They followed it this month. And everybody knows, everybody here that has been here for quite some time knows I love everything that has to do with the lips. Lip balm, lip masks, yada, yada, yada. You know I like it. This is the Seraphine Botanicals. Oh, I have the wrong thing in my hand. Wrong thing. Anyways, this is the Seraphine Botanicals Apple Plus Balm Glow Lip Mask. It says, boost hydration and glow with this protective lip mask formulated with shea butter, apricot, plus ahoba, and rosehip oils that work synergistically to keep lips chat-free, soothed, and plumped all at once. It's made with green apple and pineapple extracts to help rid lips of unsightly dead skin cells and fine lines. Retail value, $25 for this little tube, but I'm going to tell you, I've used this before and I used it the other day. It's, it's amazing. Super amazing. But I'm going to show you this. Your lips will thank you you try this on the first time a little goes a long way like i said with most products but i'm serious about this a little goes a long way and it lasts throughout the day for me and then i play it at night and my lips as soon as i wake up my lips do not feel chapped they do not feel dry they feel highly moisturized and i'm really i'm really glad about that because most mornings i wake up and you i've got this like dryness cracking stuff that builds up underneath i know it's disturbing to talk about because it makes you cringe but honestly with that your lips are just gonna be happy and the last thing in here was the one i had in my hand where is it this one i tried to and i love it <laughs> i just i love it this is a great box this month this is the Bali Balm Sweet Orange and Coconut Lip Balm. Essential oils of sweet orange and coconut give it this give this lip balm its citrusy tropical aroma and silky smooth consistency. Sweet orange is packed with vitamin C, which is known to even skin tone and protect against free radicals. Coconut is a natural emollient that moisturizes for soft, supple lips. Now for this one, okay, the other one is $25 and amazing. It's an amazing product. This is quite expensive. It's $33. $33. And I'm going to tell you, it definitely is worth it. I didn't think it was. I looked at the price and I was like, $33 for this? And then as soon as I tried it, I'm going to show you. Tell you the truth. I did try it. You see this? And this is what I always love to have due to the fact I do not want to put my finger in it and contaminate it. So this goes on my lips. I make sure my lips are clean before I apply it. But it smells so good. And you can use this as your primer for before you put your lipstick on. Before you put any lip stuff on. Like color, some kind of tinted uh, lip, lip. What do you call it? A tinted lipstick. Well, what is it called? A tinted chat stick? Or what have, what is it called? Um, anything, any color that you want to apply. I'm so sorry. I'm just not all there in my mind because I'm excited about this product. But you can apply any kind of lipstick, any kind of lip liner, whatever you want without it um, ruining the effect of the product. Most uh, primers that I apply to my lips, you know those lip primers, the... Um, it looks like a chapstick and you put it on your lips. And it's supposed to prime the lips before you apply your lipstick. But then you go to doing that and it leaves a certain film and it starts to build up these itty bitty balls and like balls of film 
that come off your lips and it's just not worth it because the stuff doesn't stay on. This one, as soon as it absorbs, your lips are so, so freaking soft and supple that when you put apply your stuff, your lipstick, anything for your lips, I'm sorry, it stays on. It stays on like it's supposed to and your lips stay hydrated. Now you would think with this having coconut oil in it that it's going to dissolve that makeup or make the makeup come off. That does not happen. Not with this. Apparently, uh, that's what I thought, but no. That does not happen with this. All right, so that is it. That is all that was in my regular boxy charm. I want to go ahead and say <laughs> thank you to my hair for trying to stay down a little bit. <laughs> okay, anyway. Thank you all so much for stopping by and watching me open or unbox my boxy charm for the month of January. If you can, if you have not yet, go ahead and like this video if you want to, but you don't have to subscribe. Now remember, once you do subscribe, if you can, go ahead and hit that notification bell that's down below. That way you get notified of my next video. I can't wait to see y'all next time. Love you. Bye.